Salaman Salaman. <clears throat> Today we are going to start lecture 28. As I promise, so this will be for the angel Jibrail and Mikael. So today I will discuss Jibrail in the light of the Hadith traditions and Sunnah. And the next lecture will be what is Jibrail according to the Quran. So this is the description of Jibrail in the light of Hadith. So the, the below mentioned Hadith about the shape or form of Jibrail contradict to each other. So they were there giving the description of the Jibrail. So they are contradicting to each other. They don't know what they are talking. So these writers have stated that Jibrail is an ordinary turban man dressed in two green garments, astride a horse or a mule, small horse. Islamic tradition concerning Jibrail largely agree with the biblical accounts of Jibrail. So they have borrowed this description or whatever the shape of Jibrail from the Bible literature. But his special relation with Muhammad has inspired a mass of mythical details. So it was now Muhammad is not over here. So where is the Jibreel now? What is doing? His duty is finished. So this is the, you know, from the Islamic literature, I have taken this, you know, his form or shape of the Jibreel. The angel Jibreel would often take on the shape or form of a man, so he can change according to the Islamic literature or Hadith literature. When appearing to the prophets, so when he came to Muhammad, so Jibrail changed his form or shape. At other times, he would share Revelation by audio voice only. Sometimes he come in the form of a man or, or angel, but sometimes only voice, audio form. And one of these, Umar reported that a man once came to a gathering of the Prophet and his companion. Nobody knew who he was. He was extremely white with white clothing and jet black hair. So this is the Umar reported. Then another of these. The Prophet Muhammad, however, was the only one who saw Jibrail. Look, it contradicts the before. In his natural form, this hadith contradicts the above mentioned hadith. Muhammad, there are another hadith. Muhammad generally only heard the voice of his inspiration, but according to Aisha, he saw Jibrail twice in the shape that he was created. So Muhammad is saying something, Aisha is saying something. What a joke. And on other occasion, he took on a form resembling Daya ibn Khalifa al-Kalbi, an extraordinary handsome disciple of Muhammad. 
So he was a very handsome lad. He was the disciple of Muhammad. So they are saying the shape of the Jibrail was in remembrance with the disciple of Muhammad, this name. Then another of these, Muhammad was able to see Jibrail in the natural form during the space journey. There's another contradiction. So when he went to ascension, so Muhammad saw him. Now, wings of Jibrail. It is also reported that Angel Jibrail carried out the destruction of the city prophet Lot by using just the tip of one wing to turn the city ups and down. So many. I have brought a, a few over here. The Islamic literature is full of all this garbage, you know. So, Prophet Lut, honorable prophet, he used, according to this, he used Jibrail to destroy a city. Others have described the archangel having 6,000 wings. 6,000. And one doctor who, uh, who did the PhD in Islam, I have listened to his video, he's saying that to cover the distance of these wings, you have to travel 6,000 years also. He, he, he did the PhD in Islam. Each pair so enormous that they crowd the space between east and west. East and west. Also, Jibrail has also been portrayed as a sitting on a chair suspended between heaven and earth. So just like a chair, on the sport of his wings. Between the heaven and the earth. Where is the heaven? Earth is over here. This we have made a Jahannam. The popular image of Jibrail called Brock. It is from Arabic language work, electricity. As an ordinary turban man, dressed in two green gar garments, has tried a horse or a mule or a broad. So this is, I have taken say images, present below are some images of the broad. So this broad, it is a 19th century toy for Kondapuli, Andhra Pradesh broad. It is their broad. So this is not only in Muslim. This is all religion, you know. Then, this Albrog, this is a painting from, painting, interpreting Persian animals. This is from Iran, 70, 70 to 75. So they, Iranian, they think this is Jibrail. Okay. Then, this is a Pakistani brat in Asia. It's beautiful. So they are saying Jibra is like this. So this is what is the literature we have about Jibra. Now, image of Pakistani most beautiful brat. So they are all the shape of the Jibra. Now another of these, Jibreel became Muhammad's constant helper. He and the Archangel Michael, Mikhail, sorry, Mikhail, Mikhail purified Muhammad's hearts in preparation for the, for the Prophet ascension to the heaven. So Muhammad, they are taking Muhammad to the heaven Why they are making the operation of the heart. Mikhail also purified heart of Muhammad, Miraj, and the Jibrail guided him through the various levels until they reached to the throne of God. 
So this is the Muslim has the concept of the God. And that is why they have been living in a worse situation because their concept or their belief of God has destroyed them. And this has been created by all of the religious leaders. And still they are doing from all the mosques. Then another of these, Jibreel gave the call of prayer in mosque of Alexa before the journey of the ascension with Muhammad. And you know, the Masjid Aqsa was not built by Muhammad. It was built by after the death of Muhammad. I have given all this detail in my one my lecture. When this mosque was built. So how come they are saying Muhammad went to Ascension or Muraj from there when there was a no room? Uh, a mosque of Aksa. Jibreel also helped Muhammad in times of political crisis, coming to his aid at the Battle of Badr with thousands of the angels. Look, all these are fabrication, you know. It's a conspiracy against the Quran, you know. And then telling him to attack the Jewish tribes of the Bani Ukraine. Why you are, you know, creating this, you know, disagreement? Why you are, you know, they are creating this hatred literature? This is their done. You know, all our religious leaders, or political leader, they were talking against the Jews in all their sermon, and now they are praying. They are talking against Christian. Now they are praying in their church, and they brought from the Quran that the Quran said, Don't, "Jews are your enemy, and Christian your enemy, and you are coming over here. You are taking." their church and paying the rent for, for your prayer, which is your business. Because there is no praying in the Quran. No idol Pita, no idol Duha, no five time prayer. You know, where you brought it? Then another of these all the messengers of other holy books are delivered to earth by Jibrail. So Jibrail know where he is because the revolution has been stopped. No more Muhammad. I don't want to open this, you know, con conflict, you know, you know, about the revolution, about the inspiration. Because today this is not the lecture for this subject. I will stick myself to the Jibrail talk, you know. Now, how the Jibrail brought the first revolution? According to the writers of Hadith and the contemporary interpreters of the Quran claim that first five verses of Surah 96 are the opening verses of the Quran brought by Jibrail to Muhammad. So what about the other Quran? Who brought to Muhammad the other? Accept this. Why they are discriminating that? And look what is the story. President Bro is the interpretation done by all present translators of the Quran. So this is the translation 96 to 15. All the classical or contemporary set. Check. The first revolution occurred as follows. The archangel Jibrail came to Muhammad in the cave and commanded him to read. Muhammad replied, I cannot read. At this, the archangel took Muhammad and said, Again, read. He said, I can't. At which the archangel embraced him 
and said, Read, in the name of thy Lord, who created a man from a clot, read, and thy Lord is the most generous, who teaches by the pen, teaches men that which the, he knew not. What is this? It's all garbage. What is this? Now this is a, this is because of this uh, corrupt translation of the Quran and the fake literature of this. This is the Muslim we have now in front of you. Dead nation. Look, if they are saying, no, the opening verse of the Quran is Surah al fatha al fatha means unlock the chapter, unlock the door, open, preface. How they, they are saying 96 to 1, or, then why they are not making the correction of the Quran? Let they should bring these 96 to 1, 5, First, and the bring Surah Al Fatih in the last. And if the first, the five first verses of Surah 96 of the Quran were opening verses, then why the Quranic translator did not rectify this serious mistake? It's a serious mistake. It's a corruption in the Quran. They destroy them. They destroy the Quran, they destroy the Muslim. Now, another thing. Details of Muhammad's heart surgery carried out by the surgeon named Jibrai. Recently, I have listened to Maulana Tariq Jameel. In his sermon, he said Jibrai was the first surgeon of the heart in this universe. And you know, he's a con artist. Look, in detail, Mawla Tariq Jamil said the same thing. He took from the Hadith. The angel did not speak to Muhammad until he first took him and placed him by the well Zamzam. He took him to the Zamzam. Jibrail opened the Prophet Muhammad's chest. Remove his heart and washed it in the water, Zamzam by hand until it was clean. Do you know? I made the analysis of the water, Zamzam, being a water treatment engineer. I had been in Saudi Arabia 30 to 40 years. The water, Zamzam, TDS salt is 1400. At that time when I was over there. Because it's a big business. Now this franchise has come to a one prince. He is mixing the water. Before it, you can buy from anywhere by Zamzam, water Zamzam, but not now because it is a good business for them. This franchise has gone to one prince, royal family. Angel Jibrail took out a black blood clot and threw it away, saying, This is a shaitan, devil, portion. Then he brought a gold basin in which was a dressing of faith and wisdom. Gold basin. Clot. Shaitan. Did Zamzam water washing. And surgeon is Jibrail. And I show the picture you. The shape of, or the form of Jibrail. It is strange. The surgeon Jibrail did not know that water Zamzam should not be used for surgery purpose because of its high salt percentage or high TDS total dissolved solid 1,500 ppm and the water you are drinking it is 100 ppm and uh, as per the UNO 
you know, health recommendation, you cannot drink the water more than 1,500 ppm. And this has 1,400 ppm. It's a heavy salt as well. After surgery in a state of confusion, Muhammad returned home to Khatija. When his wife saw him, she became very worried as he began to shiver as though he had in a fever. Now they brought the Khatija. Khatija in Arabic means that woman who delivered premature child. And moreover, this noble Milwarka, he was a Christian monk. So what they have proved, it's a heap of life. First Jamzam, surgery, then clot, and then now Khatija, and now noble Milwarka, Christian monk. So it all systematically they hatched this conspiracy. Christian Mark, Mark Warka bin Nofal confirmed that Muhammad became a prophet of Allah. Khadija left the prophet sleeping and went to see her cousin Warka bin Nofal. He was sleeping because after surgery he was sleeping to ask him what he thought about all that had happened. Varka, who was a Christian monk, was a very wise man who had read many books and had become a Christian after studying the Bible. Look, after studying the Bible, they left everything. Look, what a, this, you know, flit, garbage. He told Khatija that Muhammad had been chosen by Allah to be a messenger. Muhammad does not know, Jibra does not know, Khadija does not know, only no He put the stamp that Muhammad has become the prophet. This is your all history, your hadith, your sunnah, your Islamic literature, this is all garbage. And then they are saying, when Muhammad married to Khatija, she was 40. And then on other hand, they are saying when Muhammad married to Asha, she was nine, six or nine. Where will go? It reflects that Muhammad did not know that he has become the prophet, but work of Ibn Nafal, Christian monk, confirmed that he is going to. Messenger. So look, this is your messenger. He does not know I have become the messenger. The above mentioned details have been taken from the following of these. So this is a reference. I have taken all the above mentioned, you know, these. This is, I have given all the details. And if anybody wants to check, go ahead, check it. Now, Arabic and as well as the English version of the Hadith narrated by Imam Muslim and Anas bin Malk regarding above stated surgery done as well. So they have given the further detail. I have taken from this. Imam Muslim Ramatullah. So this is Arabic. And this is the detail I'll read for you. Jibreel came to the messenger of Allah while he was playing with his playmates. He took hold of him and lay him prostrate on the ground and tore open his breast and took out the heart from it and then extracted a blood clot out of it and said, that was the part of Satan in thee. And then he washed it with water of Zamzam in a golden basin and then it was joined together and restored to the place. The boys came running to his mother, his nurse, and, and said, Verily, Muhammad has been murdered. They will 
rushed towards him and found him all right. His color was changed and I said, I myself saw the marks of the needle on the breast. So this and this is your Islam. For 1,400 years, come back to the Quran. Leave all this garbage. It's all heresy, all the translation. They're all based on heresy. Fairy tales. How did Allah create angel, devil, angel, devils, and human? It is reported in a hadith that Allah created the angel from light and devils from fire and he created the human from dirt. And in some place they are saying the jinn were created from the smoke. So no one knows how many in number the angels are, their number of the being or their nurtures except of Allah. Again, they put on Allah everything. All the bad things they put in the name of Allah. All this fabrication put in the name of Haman, put the name of Aisha. There are millions of these and millions, millions of people they have fabricated. All the fake names. Just like Abu Bakr, the father of the Bakr. Of, of cow, Usman, Panthrin, Asha, you will not find. So this is Abu Huraira, the father of the cat. So this is all fabrication. So this is the lecture today for the Jibrail based on the Hadith and Sunnah. And tomorrow, on the next lecture, or tomorrow I think I will give it to you, or day after tomorrow, who was Jibrail and Mikhail in the light of the Quran? So in this lecture, I will first give you the explanation, the word Jibrail, from where it has come, it is came from the word Al-Jabra. Look, the Quran used that term Al-Jabra. That is why Quran says, Rabbul Alameen. The Federation based on the knowledge, not he is the Lord of all the universe, it's totally wrong. If he is the Lord of the, all the world, why the people are dying with starvation? Why there are wars? Why he not stopping it? Rabbul Alameen means the, the, the Federation, the union of the Quran based on the, on the Quran. So, Jibrail from Algebra, and Algebra you know. So, I will explain you first all the details with grammar, with the lexicon. Then I will give you three verses. There are three verses in the Quran in which the word Jibrail comes. And you will see how much injustice they have done with you, with Quran, with Allah. And these mosques. They are the den of this fabrication because it is their business. They are all parasites. So thank you very much.